So fall's approaching and you might start to get a slight breeze of that cool weather, but it's not too cool to start wearing a jacket, but it's also not too warm to just wear a shirt. So what do we wear? Well, that's when the shirt jacket comes in, AKA the shacket. And in this video, I'm gonna show you a few ways how you can style it this season. Let's go. What's up YouTube? Welcome to today's video. My name is Richard from Assembled Style and if you're new here, welcome. In this channel we cover everything from men's fashion, lifestyle, and just self-improvement overall. So if you're interested in that, make sure to hit that subscribe button and for my returning subs, you guys already know what to do. I don't have to say it, but I'm gonna say it anyways. Please make sure to hit that like, make sure to comment. You know I love hearing from you guys, but yeah, let's go right into it. All right, so the shacket. It's slightly more than a shirt, but less of a jacket. The shirt jacket comes in many different fabrics and styles. This one is actually made out of a cotton and linen blend, so it's super lightweight and it's just perfect for that light, cool weather. Now let's quickly move on to colors. So to get the most wear out of this thing and you know make it easier to pair with you know practically anything in your wardrobe, I highly suggest you just stick with the colors navy, gray, and olive. For me personally, I love olive because it gives it like this badass military inspired look. And speaking of military inspired, you could also go with a camel print shirt jacket. And this one has, you know, the epaulets on the shoulders, making it more badass. Now for fit, honestly, it's really up to you. For me personally, I like to have everything fitted. And when it comes to the shirt jacket, of course, I'm not gonna get it fitted like, uh, like I do with my dress shirts. I'm actually gonna leave a little bit more room in order to add in more layers. Now, if you're a younger guy or you just really like to go, you know, a little bit baggy or you like more of the street style look, then you could definitely go with, you know, an oversized look, especially if you're gonna rock camo. Now for versatility, of course, it works for everyone across the board, no matter what kind of style you're rocking. And you know I got you with those example outfits. So let's briefly go over these outfits. Now for look number one, this is just young, cool, and casual. This is for like somewhat of a bad boy who goes to class and he sits all the way in the back and he just plants his feet on the table. I don't know, but yeah, in this one, in this outfit, I'm just, I just paired that shirt jacket, wore a, you know, a fitted hoodie underneath, threw on some black ribbed denim and a pair of old school fans. Just very cool outfit here. As for the next look, it's still casual. It's slightly more elevated and just a little bit more cleaner compared to the first outfit. Now I decided to go very earthy here with that same olive shirt jacket and I threw a burnt orange t-shirt and I paired it with some light gray denim and decided to finish it off with these light tan Chelsea boots. All right, so for the third outfit, I decided to elevate it just a notch by adding a collared denim shirt. I think, you know, this lightweight denim pairs very well with that olive shirt jacket. Threw on some off-white denim jeans and a pair of these light tan chucker boots. This is just a little bit more, more refined and more rugged, I would say. I mean, you could also throw on a flannel as well if you wanna make it a little bit more masculine and rugged. But yeah, this look works very well. All right, moving on to the next outfit. This is the most formal way that you can pull this shirt jacket off. And we are going business casual here, as you can see. Now I have that same olive shirt jacket, threw on a button down collared you know, white dress shirt and paired it with this knitted, you know, burgundy tie and a pair of navy chinos with some tan Oxfords. Really love this look right here. Now, a quick tip for those who plan on going with the business casual look that I put together. Now for me, I like to treat this shirt jacket like a blazer sometimes. So what I do is I button the middle button of that shirt jacket and I actually fold the placket out and this creates a notch lapel. And this is just gonna refine the look just more and it's just gonna make it cleaner overall. But yeah guys, try that out. Yeah guys, that's something you can start doing for this upcoming fall. And I'm gonna leave the links down below for those shirt jackets that I purchased. They're very cheap and very affordable. I think they're on sale as well. But yeah, that wraps up today's video. Thank you guys for watching once again. And we are almost close to 500 subscribers. That is just crazy to me because I'm not even a year in in this YouTube thing and you know when I first started a hundred was my goal and it's just crazy how I'm so close to 500 man. Seriously guys, thank you for that and I don't know, penis reveal at 1k subs, I have no idea but we're definitely going to do something special 
for 1K. All right, guys, that wraps up today's video. Thank you guys for watching once again, and I'll see you guys next video. Peace.